Well, we are actually, this is our 10 year anniversary. We are married now for 10 years. So, um, yeah, Monday actually said, um, yeah, you can actually go, can go on. Um, so I always was, I was looking for something that we can do on our 10 year wedding anniversary. Something to remember this year by because, you know, as you all know, marriage is hard. So um, for us, 10 years is a big year. Um, we've been through a lot of struggles and a lot of battles. And um, so one day this advertisement just popped up on Facebook. Um, what is so ironic is we have never watched the show before. So then this advertisement popped up on Facebook and I show it to Machil and I say to him, I think we should enter my kitchen rules. And we never actually thought we were going to get this far. No, it was just that first edition and then you present your meal and then you have this cook-off thing and then they started contacting contact us and then we realized well we we actually in now so yeah it, this is it's fun yeah it's been like crazy roller coaster um it is for me it's just a uh, yeah how can i how can i say it it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a journey and um it's like you do something if you start something you you want to finish it and um with us as a married couple i think there's going to come challenges that you need to work together and stick together and i think that's a little bit of an advantage because we've got our own business as well we've got a guest house so we cook together and um yeah yeah i think the question in just i i think the question in this competition is just can you handle the pressure uh, my favorite dish is definitely um, a fillet steak. I love a good piece of fillet that was brine on the fire. And with that, I just love a beautiful garden, any kinds of salads and a potato. Really big baked potato. <laughs> I'm very traditional and I'm going to be honest, pop and braai flesh. <laughs> I promise you I braai like four times a week. And in this competition, they will definitely be popped from my side, but I'll do a twist with it. We'll make it, some, make it look nice, but for me, it's just pop and shiba and bryflas. And it's not just a choppy, it's a choppy, a vorsi, a susati. <laughs> now we bry, it's not one meat, you eat yourself. Duck. <laughs> okay, can I be honest? I am, no. No, I am. I, I started, <laughs> I was born actually in a restaurant in Cape Town. My, my mom had one. So um, when we started the, the guest house, it was just more like hospitality, check-in guests. And then we started to realize that, okay, we have children. We're getting children now because we were married. Yeah, we had a honeymoon baby. Honeymoon baby. And I was only 20 years old. So yeah. that was quite tough. Yeah. And then, you know, we... You had to make extra money. And so we started to do breakfast and then we started to do dinners and then now we're in big conferencing so yeah so that is um and then actually i've learned her a little bit and she learned herself and now she's a little bit better than me but i'm, not, so, I'm so glad you admit but that. not with making a pot of pop or bryflas <laughs> professionally well, we've got the guest house, so and, we yeah. um, are in the hospitality industry, mm. so our life is all about people, 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 food, 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 and entertain. people, <laughs> and entertain. Okay. We have a lot of debt. Yeah, I'll take 100,000 and take it to Mauritius, and then I will pay 900,000 down payment. I'm not, gonna, <laughs> I'm not going to even think about it, I'm just going to pay it off. Because I promise you, you can give money out on... But I want a new car. <laughs> you can forget it. <laughs> you can forget it. 